NASA has a ton of open APIs that anyone can use to access their data, which is amazing. And I had such an ambitious idea for my final project. I was like, I'm gonna create like this amazing robust web app that incorporates so many of these APIs to do something really cool. I actually still would 100% like to do that as an actual legit project. But just given time constraints, I wanted to give myself a more reasonable time frame and more reasonable goal. So instead of mute molt, uh, rather instead of using a ton of different APIs, I ended up just using two. So one is EONET, the Earth Observatory Natural Event Tracker, and the other is Astronomy Picture of the Day. So I'll start with the EONET. So the way this is set up is that it's calling the EONET and then it's going to return a JSON object with a bunch of data. The hard part about this was correctly parsing that data so that it would show up correctly. So for example, like, this ID and description are pretty straightforward, but the EONET link, category ID, source ID, source URL are all within an array within, I think, another array in the JSON object. So it took some time to figure out how to properly get into that array. NASA has this awesome website called astronomypictureoftheday.gov, something like that. And really every day since 1995, a few different people at NASA have uploaded a really cool astronomy picture. One thing I noticed about that website is that there isn't a button, or at least I couldn't find one that allows you to just click like, oh, random image. So this is really what's happening here. So this is a NASA random photo thing where every time you refresh this page, it'll be a new photo with the correct information from the API. So Pluto at night, and then the date where it was uh, featured as the astronomy picture of the day. So this is Pluto, that's crazy. And then down here is gonna be the description straight from NASA. But let me go ahead and refresh this page. Boom, opportunity on Mars. So this is from 2004. So we can see right away, it's just allowing us to get a cool glimpse of all these different photos and descriptions straight from NASA from years, like literally like over 20 years of photos. So this is from 1997. So this is like, but it, yeah, it just looks amazing. Country. So yeah, my project's title is NASA APIs uh, for the CS50 final project. And my name is Daniel. My city, I'm currently living near LA in uh, California in the US. But yeah, thanks for watching. Hope that was helpful.